enjoy a Taken off. You don't look so good. Just stay the same. Oh, but I plan to go back to work after having the baby. We'll just have to split up the housework, okay? You can't throw your clothes everywhere anymore. You're going to have to watch yourself from now on. You know what I mean, right? Sub subtitle on. is the Inquisition, where one is tried based on the weight of his sins. This day, you... Woo! <laughs> 
little more. This far? Admirable. <sighs> I should get going. How much longer are we gonna stop oh, man. Here you are, lost land. Nah. Have people ever told you? <laughs> you chose that one. I'm slowly. Now, once you're past this, finally. It's too thick. This is the final air. A steep face, is it?
Congratulations are in order for your skills. The Inquisition was unable to extract your secrets. So, what did you want to talk about? Huh. What are you doing here? Oh. Are you okay? Did you drink too much last night? You called me over. You don't even remember. Huh? No way. Uh, I mean, yesterday, I... <sighs> What's wrong? You're acting weird. Weird? Me? God, why can't I remember the time I spend with you? It's like... The important parts are missing. Oh, I remember them, though. <laughs> uh, well, I wonder why I... <laughs> so... Huh? Hey, what's this long hair? <laughs> Shit! That's Catherine's! Gotta play it off. No telling what she'll do. Oh, that's mine. Probably off my chest. <laughs> you know, manly. <laughs> huh? Your chest? Really? Yeah, yeah. Y you know, uh, it's it's that. Well, you know, when sometimes a long white hair grows on your body, it's it's good luck. But this is like really long. Yeah, I was growing it out. Guess it just fell out by itself. <laughs> good thing too. It's bad luck if you pull it out yourself. You know. Oh, really? It's not from another girl, is it, Vincent? No, why, why would you say that? You know, because if it is, I'm going to die right here. Hey, 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 hey. knock it off with all the dying stuff, okay? Then I'll kill you. <laughs> I die, or I kill you. Which would be better? Hey, come on, come on, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! Fine, I'll give you five seconds. If you don't answer me, I'll kill you. One, two, huh? three, four. Hey, come on, come on. Quit fooling around. Five. There's no other girl. You're imagining things. Hmm. Is that the truth? Of course it is. Hmm. <sighs> okay, I trust you. Thanks. <sighs> Was she serious? Man, I know she's trouble, but she is smoking hot. I'm not going to ask you about the past. It doesn't matter. But from now on, if you ever cheat on me, I'll be angry. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah, to get that, do you? Whoa, 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 wait, hold on.
What the heck? Why is this locked? Unchain this door. Uh, sure. But uh, hold on a second. <laughs> <laughs> it is my landlady. <laughs> she was trying to open the door. <laughs> hmm? The landlady? Yeah, I forgot to pay my rent last month. <laughs> you know how it is with money. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. I'm gonna use the bathroom. Oh. <sighs> Vincent, what is this? Will you keep it down? Huh? One of my bosses is here. Huh? Really? Not the best time for you to be. Maybe I should at least say hello. <clears throat> he gets real grumpy if you wake him up. He's sleeping in the back. Well, if you really think it would... <clears throat> huh? He's awake? Yeah, hurry up! Now hey! Go, 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 go. <clears throat> Sorry, really sorry. I just wanted to protect you from the smell. Huh? He really smells. You know, and he was drinking last night. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm glad I got you out in time. Whew. Hey, we're not that close, but he kind of forced his way in while he was drunk. Oh, well, he is your boss, huh? Yeah, he is. He just seemed really stressed, so I came to see how you were doing. Well, thank you. Uh, come by after work and I'll complain some more. <laughs> oh, I got you something from the new shop that opened up. Oh, uh, yeah? Here. I'll see you later. Owen, oh, I am pregnant. <laughs> I just wanted you to know. Oh, my God. That was my last hope. You don't know how that makes me feel. Seriously. See ya. gonna sit here and let this happen. Hmm? You got a mail. Oh. Pause. God, look at her. Oh man, look at those. What am I doing? made up my mind. I can't let her tempt me. Shit, if she finds out, I am screwed. I gotta do something quick. No time to think about the future. But still... Did you see the movie where the guy was, uh, you know... Shut up, asshole! And just give me some toilet paper, please! Well, quit mumbling. I can't concentrate in here. Still, this girl... Look, girl? Hey! What are you looking at in there? I wanna see? What am I thinking? This can't go on any longer. I have to tell her to stop. Dude, do not delete that picture. So, uh... You still doing the two-timing tango? You don't say it like that. It wasn't on purpose. Well, if she is pregnant, you gotta bite the bullet. 
Yeah, you're only saying that because it's not you. Hey, man, variety is the spice of life. You need to enjoy it more. Just like the wasabi-coated sushi they serve here. You know what I'm saying, bro? You suck at metaphors. What I'm saying is, you've got options ahead of you. Yeah? Maybe Catherine would be happier as a single mom than she would be with you. Are you drunk? No, she wouldn't want that. Well, what exactly do you want here? <sighs> my mind and my heart don't exactly agree on that. Uh-huh. Well, then you've got to be even more careful. If you're caught, you can't call it an accident anymore. I know. I know. Accidents, huh? More and more of them lately. The old guy next door to me kicked the bucket. I heard. Shotgun, huh? Thought he always said like to party. Probably party too hard. He had this horrible look on his face. Really? Looks like that stuff on my mind. <sighs> anyway, have some magro. It's supposed to be good for your circulation. Huh? You're as pale as a ghost, man. Oh. You going to the bar tonight? Uh, maybe. You? Uh, I have to pass today. Got overtime. But I guess all you can do is drink and forget, huh? <laughs> Pretty much. Sometimes receive text messages on your phone. Push Y to look at your phone. the United States outlawed alcohol between 1920 and 1933? It is said that this very prohibition paved a way for the cocktail culture to bloom. Alcohol made in secret tended to taste terrible, so people began mixing it with anything and everything to make it more enjoyable. These are the roots of the modern cocktail. The more you stamp on a weed, the more it thrives. Uh, and that was the cocktail... Yep. All right. Wow, you don't look so. I know. Oh. Visit the quadrangle. I didn't expect you to climb this high.
Stepping on an ice block will make you slump. It's a dangerous hazard. Snow? Shit, it's cold. I I'm gonna freeze to death. this I got it. One, huh? I see. Here. Now, things will only get more difficult from this point on. It won't be like the previous levels. And the place you would call... <laughs> Study the terrain. Come again. Pause. Pause. Commencing area two. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> 
was a sight to see. Oh, man. That was not only that. You if the person you loved was interested in paraphilic infantilism, what would you do? Which one? Well, okay. Fine. You should give up. He's trying to skip. It's not. I think you know. <sighs> like I said before. No matter what happens. Okay. The night will. This is the fuck use. Don't run. Can't be. Can't be. Make up for it. 
Congratulations. Amazing as always. The quadrangle did not pose much of a challenge. Played here. The fuck is going on? Uh, Don't you fucking hang up on me. 
I know where you live, asshole. Huh? Look, you don't want to fuck with me, understand? Uh, I'm sorry. So you're Vincent, right? Uh... You're probably just using her, huh? No, it's not... Then you two are serious? Well, no... I'll break things off with her. I was planning to do it in the first place. In the first place? <laughs> really? Yeah. I mean, I never thought it would end up this way. <sighs> this is for your sake as well. You know the difference between right and wrong, right? I'll kill you. Yeah. Oh, what? This fucking blows. <sighs> oh, what the fuck does everyone want with me? <laughs> well, at least now I can resolve this situation with her. He said his name was Steve. In any case, Catherine's gotta agree to break up with me once I tell her about this. I'll see her one more time to have a talk. Steve. What? Really? What's this about? Why are you bringing up this Steve guy out of the blue? I got a call this morning. This guy Steve said he's your boyfriend. Huh? What? He said he was my boyfriend? Yeah. He called me up. He said he was Catherine's boyfriend. Hmm. Well, obviously someone's got the entirely wrong person. Huh? But, but I he... told you it's not me. Really? Then who is it? How would I know? Maybe it's some other Catherine you know. <laughs> yeah, like I know a... Hmm? Wait. No, 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 I can't be. Um, you really know another Catherine? Just... Just let me think for a second, please. Um... Was I the one being double-crossed? Well, if she's cheating, then I can cheat too. Both of us can be happy with multiple partners. No, 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 no. The hell am I thinking? Although, now my plan to break up with Catherine with this Steve information is ruined. If she finds out about Catherine now, I am totally fucked. I need to play this off. Hey, wait. Maybe this guy is just one of your lurkers. Huh? What do you mean? There's gotta be countless men that have fallen for you, right? Maybe one of them is still trying to get you to fall for him. And you are really cute. <laughs> huh? God, what am I saying? <sighs> anyway, maybe this guy's not even named Steve. He's probably some creeper trying to act slick. <laughs> Stop, you're scaring me. Oh, sorry. You know, let's, let's just drop it. Hey, you're the one that brought it up. Her cheating on me? It's absurd. No, it, it, that's impossible. But can I really say it's absolutely impossible? I can't. Ah. Hey, are you listening? Oh, sorry, I kind of kind of zoned out there. You know, being with you is a real pain sometimes. Huh? Oh, sorry. Whatever. I'm going now. See you later. 
Yeah. No, wait. You, you can't come over tonight. Too late. I've already decided. Seriously, tonight is not a good time for me. I, uh, had really bad diarrhea. Hmm, that's so? Well, if you're not feeling well, I guess there's no point in going. Take care. Oh, hey. cheating <laughs> that's impossible I'm not Catherine honestly man I wouldn't be surprised She's always meeting new people for work plus she doesn't always choose hey, the best guy saying right, it like I've been cheating honor? all this time Ugh, don't you get it it isn't about length jeez you men are such pigs next time she's here tell me man <laughs> I want to see her yeah this wasn't supposed to be a meetup Sounds like a huge pain. Uh, come on, stop being so down. I mean, you don't even know if she's really cheating, right? Oh. So, what are you gonna do now? What else can I do? I have to know. Seriously. I'm just in shock now. In shock, my ass. Even if it's true, you're not innocent either. You're just a selfish pig. <laughs> she's right, you know. I know. I know I'm doing the same thing. If I knew she was lying to me, I couldn't take it. And yet here I am. Oh, man. Hey, Vincent. Wow. What a loser. Dude, I can't watch this anymore. You're really bringing me down, man. So she dumped him? Yep. People say he's in bad shape. He's looking pretty messed up now. He might not pull out of this. He may even show up on the morning news. Skip. Don't show because the big talk now but Erica had a lot of problems back in the remember that time she was hurt by a relationship and disappeared huh? huh what happened <laughs> yeah, people were saying she was dead but then she just popped up out of no never knew Erica had some trauma but I'll fill every hole in her heart yeah, I'll fill every hole hey I'm serious here don't make fun of me would you like would you like You can go home at any time. Uh, this customer is a journalist. He seems to be obsessing. A legend. I was original. Hmm. Hmm. I see. Anyway, in my research. It's the truth. Oh. I found a stream. Hmm? There's there. Well, me, my, I mean. You got me.
No. Nah. With a sleep schedule like that, you... Johnny looks a... Huh? Did some... I don't... No, never mind. Toby, he's fine. I can trust him to customize a bike without watching over him. <laughs> you should spend more time tinkering with chicks, not bikes. He needs to hook up with somebody good for him. Someone besides Erica. You're so good to the little guy. How about sharing some of that love with us? Yeah, right. Crank up, Vince. My head hurts. Hey, I got the top score on that. You guys really like... You don't get why it's so... Hey, that's mean. After I got the hang of it, it's... You're the kind of guy who won't give up. Well, isn't everyone like... Well... Yeah, but you and Catherine have been to... Uh, shut up. Erica. You got mail. he mentioned wasn't her. <sighs> Can she actually be cheating on... Erica. <sighs> I know this is sudden, but here's... It's said that chugging alcohol isn't good for you, but sometimes it's necessary. The cocktail Nikolashka is an example of this. It uses cognac, lemon, coffee, and sugar. But first, you put the lemon, coffee, and sugar in your mouth. Then you take a big swig of cognac. Of course, you can't even talk until you drink it all. It's necessary to chug it. But cognac contains 40% alcohol, so those with low tolerances should not attempt this. And that was the cocktail trip. Empty? Eric. Vincent would be the guy who'd take the best care of me. Past tense? Orlando and Johnny don't look like they'd love me. Ding, ding, ding. Which means... Uh, you, I guess. You're cute and passionate. What? For reals? Yeah, yeah, congrats. Hey, hey, you got... No. Erica. Uh, I'm tired. 
up. You're going home? I know. Don't you think that everyone's acting? I'm getting worried. You worried about those rumors? I don't believe in any of that. tonight's location. This clock has been in use since ancient times. From this point on, your skills will be tested by various puzzles. Bomb blocks are lit when you walk in. Edge. 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 Edge.
Entertaining. You're really good. You've been going at a pace of one floor per night so far. Come on, hurry up and ask your question. This is the which is harder, lying or being lied to? <laughs> well, which one? Two types of how brightly they glow will help. Huh. Scant. I got it.
Good. Any sheep like that now. If you lose your mind, all you have left to lose is your life. They don't exist anymore. You see this? Are you able to show all of the contents of your cell phone? <laughs> yeah. So that's your huh? Oh yes, you're in the middle of the clock, but you're then hurry the very well. It's a race used. Just let me climb this tower like normal, damn it! Commencing area three. Are you ready? <laughs> How's this? I'll take this. I 
reached the top once again. You're quite tenacious. Would you reaffirm your trust in them, or speak to them directly? <laughs> that one, huh? Very well. Hurry up before I start getting nervous. <laughs> I expect that you... This is the final area for tonight. Observe. All right. Pause. Just climb this thing and get it over. Child with chainsaw has appeared. It's the killer. Do not die. Edge. Hey! Look out below me!
got it. A little more. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. Edge. How is this possible? All right, I got it. Use this. Okay. I just open this. A victory. No. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did I? Did I do it? has been completed. doing here anyway I, I mean they the, the ants what, what are they doing here stupid ants they're after this what is it cake well who did you get this from I can't tell her that Catherine brought it oh I've got a, a real sweet tooth is all <laughs> uh, wait really so do I <laughs> So, uh, when'd you get here? Oh, what, like you forgot? 
You said that you were feeling better, so I hurried right over. Huh? When did I tell you that? I guess my memory's a little fuzzy. Aw, you always say that. <laughs> Relax, you worry too much. Trust me, you are just fine, baby. <laughs> well, gee, thanks. Uh, oh, yeah. I uh, <laughs> don't have time today. <laughs> no! What, what is it this time? It's... It's that horror movie I told you about. This is the last week they're gonna be showing it in theaters, what? remember? What? What movie? I don't know what I'm gonna do if I miss it. Yeah, okay, okay. Can we wait till tomorrow? I've kind of got some stuff to take care of today. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All right! <laughs> hey, this will be our first real date! It'll be so much fun, don't you think? <laughs> I am totally lost here. Ugh. 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 Look, I've got to ask you something. You know what I'm talking about, right? Huh? Don't you have anything to tell me? Vincent, what in the world are you talking about? All right. I'm just going to come out and say it. W wait. Listen what's to going me. on? I uh I heard something the other day. What did you hear? Something from an acquaintance of yours. What? Who? Uh, well, do you know a guy named Steve? Steve? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know anyone named Steve. Exact. Wait, what? Y you don't? No. No? Not even one? Like I said, I don't know any Steves. Well,. How could you not? I mean, Steve's a pretty common name, right? Wait! I did meet a Steve yesterday. <laughs> yesterday? My friend's son was named Steve. I think. Son? How old is he? Um, two months, maybe? She'd just come back from the hospital. No... No, not him. Don't you know any other Steves? Huh? Well, I'm sure I do if I check. You, you mean you have to check and see if you know anybody named Steve? I guess so. Look, what is this all about? <laughs> well... Speak up and tell me. Who's Steve? Some friend of yours? What are you getting at? Well, if you don't know, then let's just drop it. But you sure you don't know him, know Steve? Why do you keep asking me that? I told you, I don't know. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Never mind. Huh? Oh, uh... <laughs> The wrong girl again? I mean, I can't think of anyone else. Okay, so now I've got to play off this whole Steve business. If she finds out about her through this, I am in deep shit. Uh, well, it, it, it's a good thing you don't know him. There's this asshole at my work who said he might know you. So, uh... Huh? Are you okay? acting weird lately. You're pale, you say things that don't make any sense. Yeah, well, you know what? There's a lot of stuff that doesn't make sense lately. Like the future and everything. I don't get it. Uh, what do you mean, you don't get it? Uh, well... Scant.
talking about? Yeah, well, I asked around, and nobody knows who you are. You scared. Catherine he was talking about was someone else entirely. Jeez. Seriously? Well, lucky Scared. for you, this was just... Cheating with. She doesn't know you're sleeping around with her, right? I'm a terrible person, aren't I? This is my fault. I'm you go. I'm gonna break up with her tomorrow. Once I'm clear, I'm gonna. I'm sure it'll. Yeah. Oh, the liquor's really hitting. <laughs> if you check the high score. Why are you both? Huh? What? I've got the high score right now. Not really? Oh, well, uh, <laughs> I'll beat you soon. You guys are really into that game. Yeah. Looks like I was the only one hiding something. Rumors bullshit. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished your glass. One style of cocktail that requires the most experience and technique to create is the Pousse Café. Normally, cocktails are stirred thoroughly. But this is a cocktail you cannot mix. The bartender creates a beautiful rainbow inside the glass by carefully layering differently colored liqueurs according to their densities. But what's the best way to drink this? Mixing it will ruin the effect. And if you don't mix it, it stays separated. Perhaps the agony of indecision is part of the Pousse Café's appeal. And that was the cocktail trip. Empty? Erica, I need a... Take your order. Rum and coffee. I'll take a beer. beer. Sure thing. <laughs> Whoa, this is... Good Would evening. you like to... Would you... You can't... You can't accept the right... She's that too. You got mail. Oh, hey, guy. I know. It's easier if we. <laughs> well, 
<laughs> what did you do? I'll see you at the See ya. Are you here? The spiral corridor is our locale tonight. It is a holy passage to the cathedral. powers will be this
How's this? Oh, man, okay. I got it. All right. All right, I got it. I made it! As I expected, you survived. I knew you wouldn't die here. Right. Well then, we'll begin. This is the eleventh question. What would you do if your significant other fell in love with someone else? <laughs> well, which one? That's your selection. I see. Hey, isn't this the seventh floor? Get past this part. Isn't the goal right there? Correct. This level leads directly to the cathedral. The eighth floor, the cathedral, is where you will find an end to this. And freedom. Right. I'm almost there then. I'll escape from this place as fast as I can. <laughs> I'll take you to the next level then. Catherine.
challenge stages will put your true abilities to the test. Try bringing down the house if you're facing a wall of holes. I got it.
Right, I got it. Right, right, I got it. Edge. I got it. Edge. Edge. <laughs> I got it. You can keep this up.
finally know what's true. I was afraid because a lot was going on. That's why I had to get out. <laughs> Let's hurry then. There's still... Trial stages continue on. Some locations will allow. Looks like I still have a ways to go. Pause. Oh, I don't have a choice. Commencing area three. Are you ready?
got it. All right, I got it. It's ringing. Edge. Get out of here. Edge.
Ugh. 
Ryan, I got it. 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 More than halfway up this lake, you will. It doesn't matter. Now take care. This is the final. Use your mind. Not gonna Pause. Gonna die. Commencing area four. Are you ready? Well, uh, I'm almost there. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. I got it. All right, I got it. Pause.
This far. I think I've misjudged you. Oh, man. Welcome, little lad. Oh, you do it. I do so much shit already. Nothing is going to scare me off now. If you had to choose between your best friend and your lover... <laughs> so that's it? That's... Well, only a very small number of sheep have ever reached... In this century, you're the first. Ugh. I hear there are more holy stairs with red carpet at the top. Get there. But if you can't... It's important. I don't know. In any case... Well... This is the what? Vincent Brooks. Pause. Pause. Who's there?
Right, I got it. Got it. Sin will just disappear. Chained down, edge. right?
Your sin will just disappear. Your sin will just disappear. You're scared of being chained down, right? There's no turning back! There's no turning back! Coward! Just a little more! You... You are... I... I don't want to die! Where... Where's Catherine? Catherine? Wait a second... You're Steve, aren't you? Huh? How do you know my name? Uh, well... I'm Steve Doe Home. I'm a dentist. I see. That voice. You're Vincent, aren't you? What a twist of fate. It looks like I'm cursed. You figured something out? I've been cursed. get a curse from that don't you get it you're cursed too it's revenge for betrayal revenge Catherine you're talking about is Congratulations! You have completed the Spiral Corridor. Some sleep. Nightmares just keep coming. Mm -hmm. I had a dream where I felt dead. I struggled and struggled, like I was being chased by something crazy. Mm -hmm. Yo, you listening? Hey, Orlando. Man, we've had these crazy dreams every night. So how come we can't remember them clearly? Hmm? Now that you mention it, I just. I can't shake this feeling. Uh, I can't remember. The series of mysterious male deaths continues with another gruesome discovery this morning. Local dentist Steve Delome, age 42, was found dead at his home. His wife, who he'd been feuding with, found him dead in his sleep this morning. Like the other victims, his body was in an atypically weakened state, inconsistent with no Hey, uh, you 
all right now? Whoa. That dead guy on the news just now, I know that guy. He lived in my neighborhood. The police came this morning. Oh, God, it was so loud. That sounds like a bad way to start the morning. That bastard was cheating on his wife with a younger woman. The entire neighborhood knew because he bragged about it to everyone. What a creep. You gotta feel bad for the kids in that situation. Oh, they didn't have any kids. But still, what a horrible man. Hey, what is it? We met last night. In my dream. Huh? Met who? I remember now. It was him. He died in my dream. Him? The guy in the news? <laughs> That's crazy talk, man. What did he say? Wait, that's right. It, it's, it's starting to come back to me now. He said it was a curse. Because he betrayed someone. Hey, cut that out. You're trying to tell me he was killed in his dreams or something? You are fucking crazy. Well, maybe not. Think about it. The rumor? Maybe it's true. The dreams we've been having every night. Did you honestly just say that? How does this tie in with betrayal? I'm the one that got betrayed. Yeah. Sorry. Enough bullshit. We just can't think straight because we're too damn tired. We wake up all bleary-eyed and the world's full of rumors. And then we can't sleep because all this crazy shit's stuck in our heads. Y you're probably right. Exactly. I didn't betray anyone. I was the one who was betrayed. So why is... Fuck. I didn't mean to bring that up. I was, I was just thinking. Ah, uh, it's all stupid. Yeah. <sighs> Man. What about you? You dumped the girl you're cheating with? Actually, I was gonna go talk to her after this. <laughs> It'll be a horrible date, but I've made up my mind. I'm ending it. I see. When this is all done. I'm gonna propose to her. To the one I know I love. Of course, I haven't bought a ring yet. <laughs> The ring can come anytime. Good luck. Yeah. Hey, what's up with Vincent over there? You just leave him alone. Don't get messed up and all that. Oh, hey. There's something I wanted to tell you. Check this out. Yesterday, I finally became a man. Got rid of my V card. Boom. Uh, wait, back up. With who? Take a wild guess. It shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> Erica. Yep, bingo. Sorry I got to her first, man. Seriously? Yeah, but there was something weird about it. You know, I can't really explain it. It's probably just because it was my first time. Maybe, you know, just my imagination, but... So what happened to Johnny? You coming by yourself? <laughs> yeah, he's not coming today. He, uh, looked pretty bad earlier. <sighs> I see. Kind of weird everyone's tired all the time, huh? Vincent's infected us, damn it. Uh, so you see, I mean, there's nothing wrong with you. <sighs> so then, there's someone else, isn't there? I've been meaning to tell you all this time, but I couldn't. I had a lot of things on my mind, and then you came along. I guess I was trying to escape reality. Do you like her more than me? Look, I'm sorry. She's someone I really need to hold dear, so... Hold dear? Wait, so does that mean you're already dating her? I'm sorry. <laughs> well... I don't mind. <laughs> you don't mind? As long as I'm your number one, you can have fun with her. We can just go on like we've been doing. <laughs> well, you might not mind, but I do. Why? You want to know why. To be totally honest, she's pregnant 
with my child. <laughs> so, I've decided to marry her. You're joking, right? I'm fine with that. I just want to be your girl. This is so... No way. I, I, I couldn't live like that. I, I can't see you anymore. You can't see me. But... No. Please don't. <laughs> I guess she really meant all those things she said. Damn it, Vincent. You betrayed her feelings. You took advantage of her. <sighs> Look, it was a mistake, all right? <laughs> mistake? I'm not good looking. I, I don't have any money. So no matter how you spin it, I'm no good for you. You're still young, so you probably just went with the flow. So... It wasn't like that! Look, I know I'm being a real jerk, but we need to end this. I'll do anything else you ask of me. <laughs> anything else? What else is there? I'm going to die. Please don't say stuff like that. Just... Catherine, wait! Hey, Catherine, you okay? Do I look like I'm okay? Take it back. I... I can't do that. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'll do anything. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> Really pissing me off! You don't get it! I could do anything you want me to! I'm protecting you! Why are you trying to leave me? Are you an idiot? Yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Vincent's voice, right? Oh man, I hope he's okay. But that just means I want to be even less involved. Chief? You all right there, buddy? <sighs> We're uh, heading home now. What's the story? You staying here? I don't want to move. Oh, hi, Erica. Vincent, why don't you go home? You look terrible. I deserve it. <laughs> huh? I lied to her. I hurt her, too. You're just gonna have to swear never to do this again. It's not the right thing to do, but just pretend this was a bad dream. You don't have to try and cheer me up. I need to apologize to Catherine someday. This isn't something I can keep quiet about. Look, just don't stress yourself. Just go home early today and get some sleep, okay? Yeah, I'll go after a couple of drinks. Tonight? I think I might actually be able to get some sleep. <laughs> Toby. Uh, huh? Uh, yeah. Coming. Thank you. 
back. Catherine, wait for me. <laughs> Would you like to... Would you... <laughs> Over 70,000 people. Only 5% of those deaths become clear after an autopsy. Huh? These current deaths are part of the remaining 95%. There are probably more men who are dying in that way than we are being told. Mr. Johnson died this morning. Mr. Daniel died this morning. What? I'm excited for tomorrow. Hey, you really don't look good. It's okay. Yeah, I'm sure. Sorry for causing a lot of trouble. Apologize to the boss for me. See ya. feel rested. I haven't felt like this in a while. Wait, I didn't have any nightmares. Does that mean I'm saved? <laughs> Hello? Is anybody here home? What the hell? Does anyone here want to save big money on their internet access? Yeah, right. Sleep. Oh, sorry, but you weren't answering your phone. Um, we need to talk, okay? We do? Okay. Come on in. <laughs> Hello? Uh, huh? Who's that? Uh, what, what, what are you doing here? Oh, God, this can't be happening. So you need to have a chat with Vincent, right? Come in, make yourself at home. <laughs> How about a cup of coffee? We are going inside, and you're going to tell me exactly what's going on here. So, if I'm not mistaken, it would appear you have another woman in your life, yes? No, no, no. It, it, she's just... I... If you're going to make excuses, can you at least look me in the eye? <laughs> Let me get this straight, then. You got into this even though you knew I was pregnant. With your child. Shit. I need to figure a way out of this. No, 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 no. That, that isn't it. So ah! what is it then? I thought you were acting a little weird recently, but this? It, it's not what you think. So much is going wrong. You gotta believe me here, okay? Here you go. And two sugars for you. Just the way you like it, Vincent. <laughs> Hey, you... So what do you think? Maybe now would be a good time to break it to her, Vince. She's extra baggage in your life, right? <gasps> uh, I, I never said that. What are you saying? And I don't want to hear any more of your bullshit. Vincent, honey, you're not really gonna try and play dumb now, are you? After all you've done to my body? Night after night? Uh, pig. If you work hard enough to get something, you'll get it. Don't you think that's true? Well, he worked me hard, and now he's got me. Simple as that. 
Plus, I'm sure you have no idea of this even, but this one's a wild man in the sack. <laughs> I don't think you can satisfy him anymore. What? What are you, damn sick in the head or something? Listen, honey, Vincent here only needs one thing in this world, all right? And it's sitting right next to him. Now take a hint and get out of here. Why the hell should I? You're the one who should be leaving, bitch! Careful, you keep making faces like that and you'll start getting wrinkles, you old granny. Why, you! You little whore! Damn it, Vincent! I've just gotta calm them both down. <clears throat> um, so, uh, uh, can you ever forgive me? <gasps> you want me to forgive you? How can I? W wait a second, I can explain. I will never forgive you! Hey, hey, stop me! <laughs> Looking for this? Hey! Take it easy, will ya? Look, just listen to me. I've already called it off with her. She just snuck in here, okay? Please, you gotta believe me! It's because of you that Vincent's so confused right now! If you just go away, he could finally be free! Uh, are you crazy? Uh, 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 Get away! Uh, don't you run away from me! Catherine! No, 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 no. Is this really happening? Catherine? Look at me. Calm down. Calm down! Just calm down. Everything is gonna be fine. Listen, you go home right now. Leave the rest to me. Just do it! But I... Come on! What is going on? What is this? What the hell is this? I won't let you get away. That voice. It's her. What is this, Vincent? We... we have to run. Catherine, follow me! <laughs> Welcome to the cathedral. This final stage requires you to call your companion to guide her. Pause. Got it. Edge, edge. 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 Edge.
We made it. Catherine, we're gonna be all right. We can make it back through here. Make it back? Back to where we were. Let's go together. I'm sorry. I can't think of the future after all this. Catherine, calm down. You've got a child to think about too. I'll fix everything. It'll all be okay. What? You mean you and me? You still thought about us then? Of course I did. But I can't believe you anymore. I didn't want to cheat on you. I was just confused about our future, I guess. I snapped. I'm sorry. I know I did something I can't undo. I won't make excuses, but I realized something. How dear you are to me. I... I understand that now. Vincent. Please, Catherine, come with me now. I'm begging you. But I can't. I can't do it anymore, Vincent. You should just go. Catherine! You just gotta believe in me. Please, Catherine. I can't lose you. Not like this. Vincent, do you? Congratulations. That was a splendid climb. The cathedral was not your final resting place. Right? What? What's going on? Y you came to visit me in this room, and she just. That's right! Where is she? Where's Catherine? Catherine? No, not you! Huh? Catherine! Hey! Hey, Catherine! What the hell? What is going on? Huh. So that's what's going on. What's going on? What's going on? You didn't see her? Nope. She doesn't seem to be here today. Look, we have to talk. Huh? You've been cheating on me, haven't you? Do you admit it? So, well, well, yeah, I, I admit it, but, but everything's good now. After all, I... Just stop babbling for a second. You haven't made a bit of sense this entire time. 
<sighs> You're such a disappointment. <laughs> Hold on. You really don't remember anything? Are you still dreaming? You didn't answer your phone, so I came by. You were writhing around in your sleep. Huh? By myself? Yeah. So then I woke you up just now. No oh, way. So then... That was all a dream. A dream. Ugh. Hey, look. Oh, hey! Thank God you're safe. A lot of things have happened, but... But I get it now. I promise to treat you right. Huh? Well, oh... The baby. <laughs> I mean, I promised to treat the two of you right. <laughs> uh, about that. Yeah, I finally understand now. I realize just how much you mean to my life. So, what I'm trying to say is... Like I said, about that. Uh, what? Listen, it turns out I wasn't pregnant. It was all a mistake. A mistake? Yes. I, I mean, are you sure? So let's break up. Break up? Wait, she wasn't pregnant? I fixed the cheating situation, so everything's supposed to be back to normal, right? So what's the problem now? What? Break up? Okay, no, just, just wait a second. You're cheating on me with a girl named Catherine, right? A girl with the same name as me. No, hold, hold on there. I was just confused. I am done with her, okay? And I won't ever see her again. Plus, I was gonna apologize to you. It's true, so please, forgive me. It isn't about forgiveness. Look, did you think I didn't notice? <laughs> I've been with you this long. Of course I noticed. Oh, the prank calls must have been from her. Wh what? I'm actually relieved to know that I'm not pregnant. To tell you the truth, I knew earlier, but I couldn't tell you. I felt like you'd leave me. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is going on? I mean, of course, if it wasn't for the pregnancy, I might not have decided to get married. Come on. I finally realized that I only cared for Catherine. Oh, hold on a second. Just, just listen to me. I wasn't serious about her. I, I don't even think about her anymore. You are all that I need, Catherine. Just back there in the dream, you and I, we... <sighs> Snap out of it, Vincent. I came here to break up with you. What? No. Uh, you're joking. Right? When I thought I was pregnant, I was scared the entire time. But I thought maybe you'd be happy for me. I, I was happy for you. You're lying. No, 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 I'm not. It, it, it just caught me by surprise, that's all. It's okay. Besides, I didn't come here to discuss that. Look, we can fix this. Hit me, punish me, whatever you like. I'll do anything for you, okay? None of that will change anything. Then what do you want me to do? Nothing. There's nothing left between us, so don't call me. You're serious? Can't you tell? I'm going now. Oh, that's right. I brought you an energy drink. Um, I'll leave it here. So drink it. Well, this is farewell then. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> is this real? Or am I just still dreaming? Is it really over?
It is. It really is over. I've been with her this long. I know when she's serious. I can't believe it. What am I supposed to do? Catherine. It's been so long, like five years. It's just my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. She's worried about me. She knows I've got a career that keeps me busy, but I mean, it's easy to keep things like they are now. But this month, I'm running really late. I think I'm pregnant. I've been getting strange texts lately. I don't know. They don't make sense. It's just creepy. Look, Vincent, you're not hiding anything from me, are you? Hey, do you think we'll work out? This isn't just because I got pregnant, right? I can trust you, right? I've been scared ever since I thought I was pregnant. I knew that it was going to freak you out. I guess this is farewell then. Goodbye. I see this weary feeling. I can't remember the last time I was alone in the city. Man, what a fucking dump. Damn it, what the hell am I supposed to do? Catherine? Uh. Catherine? Oh, uh, hi. A bug? Um, no, I'll definitely swing by probably later in the evening. Yes, sorry about that. Yeah! <laughs> oh, it's cold. Man, I can't believe this. Don't get so down, man. You'll end up dying for real. Hey, I wouldn't happen to be in the middle of a dream right now, would I? Huh? Wow, you are fucked up. I mean, who dreams about taking a shit with another guy? <sighs> hey, was she serious? <sighs> yeah. She's not answering my calls. I expected that, though. Uh, in hindsight, maybe you shouldn't have dumped that other chick, huh? How about that? I broke up with her at the bar, and yet the next day, Catherine came to my room, and she was there. It was a horrific scene. Man, am I glad it was a dream. But it feels weird. I, I feel like it wasn't a dream. Dude, if it wasn't a dream, your ex-girlfriend would be all over the news. After all, you told me she stabbed the other girl, right? So, uh, what's the deal then? Cheating girl hasn't called you either? I don't know. I doubt it. What do you mean, I doubt it? You, <laughs> you haven't checked. Nothing's here. Ah, uh, no calls, huh? Ah, it's too bad. No, 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 no. It, it, it's all gone. What's wrong? You had a toilet paper in there? Well, I gotcha. Dude, it is seriously gone! What the hell is this? Chill, I'm getting you some right now. I'm over here too. It's, it's all gone! I... Just hold on. Damn. Not the goddamn toilet paper! Her texts! They're all gone! Fuck, her info too! Uh, her info? Not just that. Incoming calls, outgoing calls. 
Number two? Everything related to it, it's all gone! You disappear? Hey, what about that one pick? Oh, that pick! I can't find it. It's missing too! The fuck, man? You never got to see it. What is going on? Maybe Catherine deleted it when she found out you cheated. When you weren't looking? She wouldn't do something like that. Well, maybe the girl you dumped did it. That's not it. I used this phone to call her yesterday. We met, we split, and, and that was that. Yesterday? Where was that? What do you mean, where? At the bar. Where else? You guys were watching. We saw it? Yeah. Uh, I didn't see anything. What the fuck are you talking about? You saw me with her! Huh? With who? After that mess with her, you guys came by and tried to cheer me up, remember? You don't remember that? Uh, yeah, I remember that part. But all I saw was you looking pathetic by yourself. By myself? Yep. But she was with me, right? I said I didn't see her. Hell, I never even saw her once. <laughs> You're joking, right? Johnny and Toby never saw her either. We've only heard about her from you, numbnuts. We thought you were doing that to prevent Catherine from finding out. <laughs> yeah. Like I'd have the brains to do that. Whatever. Look, I only saw you yesterday. You were all fucked up, man. You tried talking to me, but you just sat there holding your head. No way. Look, man. I mean, hate to say this, but maybe you really are starting to lose it. I mean... Stop saying that. You're making me question my sanity here, man. Uh, you were sane before? I mean, you guys were just distracted, right? That's impossible. That would be like... Huh. Boy. Okay, hold on. Huh? In a bar like that, it looks like hers. No one... No. That's impossible. Maybe she was a dream girl. <laughs> Hey, come on. Talk to me. I can't. This is so fucked. Hey, it was a joke, man. All traces of her are gone. Nobody's seen her. This can't be real. Dude, you're really scaring me, man. You honestly sound crazy now. Vincent, maybe you should- Shut up! I'm not crazy! It's her fault I'm going through all this! She's got to fucking exist! This is all bullshit! I'll agree with you there, pal. I'm splitting, okay? Hey, wait, wait. What? The cell phone just glitched, that's all. And last night, you just weren't paying attention, right? Again with this? I didn't see anything. Don't you believe me? <sighs> Whatever, man. I, I know. Erica must have seen her. She works there. She might know something about her. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Just come to the bar with me tonight. I will show you that you're wrong. It's okay, man. I'm fine with being it's wrong. It's not okay! Jeez. What's up with you, man? Hey, so did you and Catherine really break up? Yes. Oh, I see. Enough about that. Back to yesterday. Try and remember. Uh, I told you already. Seriously? Yeah, you're talking about last night, aren't you? I remember everything. You came here alone. You left alone. Uh, and the entire time you were here, you drank alone. Right, Toby? That's exactly how I remember it. Maybe you're just spacing out from lack of sleep. After all, you were pretty messed up last night. Uh, yeah, you were totally fucked up, dude. So, so, so what? I, I was just dreaming the entire time I was here? I'm sick of these goddamn dreams every goddamn night. Wait, th then when did that dream start? So fucked up! Hey, man, keep it down. I'm only in this mess because I cheated with her. Come on, someone tell me, where the hell is she? Dude, I don't know. Uh, my head hurts. 
Hey, are you all right? Yeah, like that. You were by yourself just like that. Maybe you were dreaming. You're really messed up. I'm not messed up. I'm just saying that it's impossible for her not to exist. Anyway, pills, alcohol, nothing works for that. Yeah, I keep seeing it. Whoa, you guys are still having it? Although now that you mention it, Erica looked like she was having a nightmare too. <laughs> you noticed? I don't remember anything though. You too, Erica? I thought only men had that dream. So maybe gender doesn't matter, huh? Uh, well, uh, I'm not so sure. <sighs> It's because you guys won't shut up about nightmares. The same thing with the other customers, too. Is it a weird chain reaction? Hey, dreams we've been having. Don't you feel like we're all seeing the same dream? Really? I can't remember much, but you know, it felt like I was trying to get the hell away from something. Like that? Just climbing up and up. Yeah, mine was like that, too. Or more like struggling without getting anywhere. So what, we're being shown the same dream? <laughs> Dumbass. Dreams are just a reflection of daily stress. <laughs> stress? <laughs> From what? Dude, there's plenty of stress in everyday life. Oh, yeah, but... Does that mean I'm gonna have these nightmares too, eventually? Oh, man, I hope not. It's all because this jackass started talking about it. Since I've been hanging out with him so much, he's transferred some of his stress onto me. So, Vincent, how are you gonna make it up to us, huh? Huh? Out like a light. Oh, he's messed up again. <sighs> I'm going home. My head hurts. I understand being shocked, but does it really screw someone up this bad? <sighs> we have an early shift tomorrow, too. Oh, yeah, you're right. We should get going. Hey, Vincent. We're gonna take off now. You sure you're okay by yourself? Uh, I'm not crazy. The jury's still out. He's not gonna tell us he met that girl again later on, is he? Idiot. I wouldn't do that, but I did see her last night. Yeah, yeah. We've heard that from you all night long, remember? Well, thanks for the fucking help. I'm just gonna drink some more. I'll keep an eye on him, so you guys can go on home. I'm sorry, Erica. Take care of him, will you? I'll be fine. I just wanna figure out what is going on. Hey, you all right? Mind if I sit here? Uh, hi, excuse me. Mind if I sit here? What? Uh, I was just thinking about it. It's only been a week since... Since when? Since I met that girl here. Can life really change this much just like that? Mm, it happens. But maybe it's the dreams. If you don't get enough sleep, your brain won't function right, and you start seeing things differently. So you're saying that you think she's an illusion too, right? No, I'm not saying that. Yes, you are. So, to be honest, I... I don't even know what's going on myself. Fuck. A lot happened. You're probably just a bit confused. Plus, you have been drinking a lot lately. Hey, can I get an order? Uh, sure thing! Maybe I am going crazy. Fuck, man. <sighs> okay. That night, it was like this. I had a bad dream the night before, so I was here drinking, trying to forget. They all left early. I stayed here, then... Then she walked in. <sighs> Wait a second. That night, when she walked in the bar... There was something... Well, there's a lot of people here, but this isn't really my crowd. I'm sorry, miss. That's right. She spoke to someone else besides me. Oh, yes. May I help you? What 
are you going on about? No, 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 don't play coy with me. I'm talking about Catherine. You saw her, didn't you? I saw her? Um, excuse me, Don't but... fuck with me, old man! I am serious! Hey! Hey, Vincent! Everyone else said that they didn't see her. And don't you think it's crazy that only you did? You're the one that's crazy. Me? See her? Because of her, I'm starting to lose it. I already know that you're the key. Damn it, why didn't I realize it sooner? Come on, cut it out! <laughs> You saw her! I know you saw her! Speak up! Stop moaning and answer me, goddammit! Vincent! Fuck! <coughs> Just... say something. Please, man. Please. Tell me that you saw her! Well, very well. <clears throat> if you must persist. Yes, I did indeed see her. Huh? She was blonde, wearing a provocative white dress, like lingerie. Yeah, 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 that's the girl. And you saw her with me yesterday, right? Yes, of course. It's your preference, isn't it? <laughs> Girls like her. So then, you admit it. All right. See? He did see her. <sighs> Jesus. Really? You are just full of surprises. Not only did you survive this long, but to think you figured me out. Huh? I must commend you for your perception. Uh, well, I didn't really perceive anything. And sorry about the choking. A lot happened, so I was a bit freaked out. <laughs> Tell me you didn't see her. There is no way she does not exist. <laughs> well, normally that is the case. Normal people can't see her after all. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> Wait, what? That's only natural. After all, she isn't from this realm. Boss? It was rather unnatural, wasn't it? <laughs> a girl like her in a town like this? <laughs> Either way, you don't need to worry. <laughs> I have given up on showing you nightmares. Showing me nightmares? It was quite a sight, watching you run like the wind. Uh, what are you talking about? Huh? She was here, right? Her. Catherine. Huh? Uh, wait. You didn't rush me because... I just... I just wanted proof that she really existed. I knew that you saw her. You did, right? Ah. Uh, I see. Ah. Uh, hey. <clears throat> the usual, sir. Rum and cola, was it? Hey, boss. Can I ask you something? Uh, what would that be? You see, I thought that nightmares were something that you see on your own. So could it be... that... That... That someone else can show you one? Well, I... I, I wonder... Come on. Uh, well, I wonder... I wonder my ass. Pretty sure I just heard you say you're somehow involved in this. Uh, did I? You heard him, right? Huh? Uh, yeah, he did. So what was that all about? Huh? Uh, uh, what did I say? You were surprised I survived? What does that mean? I didn't say that. You said it. I didn't say it. Stop fucking with me! I know that you're hiding something! Tell me! I don't know. Why do I have to go through all this shit? Well, it's not just you. Excuse me, I was not expecting this turn of events. Fuck you! Every day is unexpected for me! And what is with these fucking shades? You are indoors! You're dealing with a desperate man now. Thanks to you and your bullshit, Catherine and I are through! So explain yourself, you fucking monster! Allow me to introduce myself. I, Thomas Mutton, am... Okay, okay. 
uh, to sum it up, when there are people like you who spend a long amount of time with a partner without commitment, it impedes the population model. The rate of population growth is less than optimal. What the hell are you talking about? So, I have these hesitant gentlemen climb that. Wait, you're talking about the nightmare? Oh, you're the one behind that? Who... who the hell are you? I have been given many names by humans since ancient times. Wasting a woman's time of greatest fertility is a hindrance to the future of the species. So we separate these non-fruitful couples and redistribute the women to men who can follow the natural order, you see? Okay, so what? You're just killing men who have a partner that they don't want to marry? Is that it? Well, to put it bluntly... You think I'm gonna accept your bullshit story? Please do not worry. You won't see that young girl ever again. Huh? She is a succubus. She appears at will and seduces men under the curse by appearing as their ideal woman. If you're going to sever ties with a longtime partner, what better way than with a messy affair, right? Oh, man. <sighs> Do you understand everything now? <laughs> yeah, I get it. I get everything. So, in the end, what am I guilty of? Uh... <laughs> if the girl doesn't exist, then it's not cheating. <sighs> if it feels like cheating, then it's cheating, right? You think... <laughs> you think you can just get away with this? Uh, well, it isn't like I just started this job yesterday. After all, the reason you were born was because we weeded out the man who was misleading your mother. <sighs> I do believe that was the case. You better stop fucking with me. If you don't wish to believe, that's fine. However, it is a necessary evil. <sighs> Having a broken heart may be painful, but you have also earned your freedom. Plus, you have a fierce will to survive. You should be able to grasp happiness again soon enough. To me, she... she was already family. I only realized that after I was dumped. How pathetic is that? I really can't help you there. This entire situation is your fault, right? So what are you gonna do about it, huh? What? You're the one who cheated. How is that my fault? Well, it sure as shit isn't mine. You're the cause of it all. Plus, I was ready to get married. You got your wish. Uh, but that was only due to your cheating on her, right? Besides, it's too late to make up with her now. You don't get to decide that. If you really intend to push me, tonight I will have to show you what I can really do. If that happens, then tonight will certainly be your last. Are you prepared to die? Prepared to die, huh? What if you die here before I do? Vincent! Hey, wait a second. <laughs> Yo, you still alive? Yeah, we came back since we're worried about you. Let's drink some more, man. Wouldn't be able to sleep anyway. I didn't have any problem sleeping. Uh, hey. Something happened? Uh, guys! Boss and Vincent are- It's okay, don't say anything. Uh, but- What's wrong? Uh, sorry, I, uh, I haven't finished my chat with him yet. You guys start the party without me. Whatever you say. Just don't go aggro, you drunk. Ah, uh, don't worry, we're just, just playing some games here. <laughs> right? Yes, that's right. <laughs> There's no point screwing around with you. I'll let you off. For now. But in return... About what you were saying? If I am still alive tomorrow, you're gonna grant me my wish. Wait, Vincent. What are you saying? I'm telling you, it's impossible. Then you should have no problem making that promise. 
If you really can control the nightmares, then make this one the last. It will be the last, whether you win or lose. Not just for me, everyone else. It ends tonight. And not only that, you're going to arrange to have Catherine meet me here. That's impossible. Well, I can't do it. I can't call her, and it's not like I can just text her. <sighs> Very well. If you agree, then I honor your conditions. Really? Great. And remember, you better keep your promise. Got it? Oh, hey, Vincent. Are you sure about this? One week of this bullshit is more than enough. And sorry to make you worry back there, but I gotta end this. Not so much with this jackass, but with myself. What's with him? Acting all badass. So wait, boss, you said... <sighs> Where, boss? Come back, you'd be in some deep shit. I was just screwing around. It didn't look like it to me. I was just getting worked up over a bet, that's all. If you say so, man. But if you do something to get us on the news, man, we're all gonna have to go on the land. Well, that sounds good. It'll be like when we were kids, out on adventures. So we're adults now, huh? Hey, what are you talking about, guys? Maybe when you're older, kid. Hey, that's mean. Hey, Vincent. What was that just now? We saw you grabbing Boss. Something happened? No, everything's fine. Sorry you had to see that. I'm not gonna stick my head into every bar brawl you get into, but if something's bothering you, let us know, okay? When we were younger, we'd always help each other as a team. Remember? Yeah. Felt like we could take on the world back then. Fun times. Uh, but Toby here wouldn't know about that, would he? Come on, why you gotta go there? We were like that once, huh? Anyway, we've already settled things. Chief and Orlando aren't looking too good. Everything will be okay after tonight. Which means... Never mind. We'll all be back to normal come tomorrow. I'll bet my life on it. Uh, what are you saying? Hey, don't look at me like I've lost it. I mean, can a guy try to sound cool sometimes? Going home, Vincent? Don't look so worried, Erica. I'll be okay. Have some faith in me. You'll see me tomorrow. Okay. I believe in you. I'll see you soon then. of the Great Trials is a road split into three paths. Beware the mystery blocks and tackle these stairs with all your wit and skill. Hey, Mutton! If you're behind this, then you can hear me, right? Say something! <laughs> of course I can hear you. I can see you. And your underpants. Ah! Welcome to my realm. His attitude is a mere human. Could go oh! I'll take this. Oh. It right, I got it. Poor to kill you immediately. Right, I got it. I was the one to bring you right. here. 
Show me those skills that helped you survive this week. Now, oh, come down. Alright, I got it.
right, I got it. How's this? said I'd be free after I beat the cathedral. Son of a bitch! My girlfriend just dumped me. I'll never accept this ending. <laughs> but you came here by your own choice. And now, I will ask you how prepared you are to pursue your freedom. This is the first question to freedom. Are you prepared to risk your life to get back together? Is that so? You're right. Just because you can see her again doesn't mean things will go well for you. Be prepared, though. All that hinting that the person who put me here was close to me, like it was a friend or a lover, when it was just the bartender. Just the bartender? I may not look it, but I am a god. Damn it. Where are you guys? Why don't you tell me who you are? All right. My name is Astaroth. I watch you humans from a world high above. Astaroth? A, a world above? What? You aren't satisfied with my introduction? That's too bad. We'll talk further on. If you're still alive. <laughs> well, wait. <laughs>
The second great trial is the Illusion Road. Monster blocks can move on their own and will fling you off if you hang on to them. Can do it next time too? I have to do it. Commencing area two. Are you ready? I got it. All right, I got it.
Edge. Edge. Yeah. 
you are quite a man. <laughs> you survived. Boxers, you're pretty. Oh, man. <laughs> you made it through that most difficult of stages. Good for you. I praise the fight in you. Before we continue, I want to make sure of one thing. I want to know what is inside you. If it's the truth within you, then your future will be blessed. This is the second question to freedom. Do you wish for a peaceful... <laughs> I see. I understand. I will answer a question of yours. You were covered in desire, in temptation, which cast you down here. Lies, deceit, betrayal. Oh, it's terrible. This is a place where sinners are tried. Haven't you heard of it? This judgment will have a positive impact on the future of humanity. So, this is about the good of mankind? Wow, that's so beautiful, it, it makes me want to cry. But why is it just men? This city is filled with traitors. I ordered him to bring the lowest of the low, like you, here. Hey, hey don't call me that. Even if, even if it might be true. But that means you're behind all this. Show me your face. You'll never see his face, not in a thousand years. Besides, isn't knowing his name enough? That's enough talk. Let's move on. I wish you the best of luck. I don't need your wishes. I'm not gonna lose. Great trial is the forked cliff. There is no one way to climb this wall. Trust your instinct. Blocks! I'm gonna climb the shit out of you! Commencing area three. Are you ready? Alright. Alright. this Yeah. <laughs> 
like this. Whoa! Edge.
I hear.
Alright, I got it. No correct answer to this. So I'm going to ask a question. I'm going to ask you one more time. This is the third. Do you wish for the excitement? will crumble quickly. Fine. We'll just keep climbing then. Commencing area four. Are you ready? Edge. 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 
Said I got it. Said I got it. Alright, I got it. Ha <laughs> ha 
got it. Got it. I'll take this. Whoa! Edge. How's this? someone becoming a legend doesn't happen often first I must praise you for having survived thus far this bullshit again what do I have to tell you this time what makes you so desperate isn't it obvious 
I'm gonna get back what I lost. Huh. Then let me ask. What? What's the point of asking? Life isn't so simple that I can just boil it down that easily. Just... who are you? What do you mean? Uh-huh. That's the curse. There's no escaping this place without having an answer of some sort. You may be different from the average man, but that doesn't mean I can let you go. I'll hear what you truly wish for. This is the last question to freedom. Are you prepared to live the rest of your life? <laughs> <laughs> That's your answer. All right. If there was once a man who took up this challenge, just like you. This man became a legend. He stopped being human and became one of us. <laughs> yes, he is Thomas Mutton, the one awaiting you at the next trial. Now that he has become one of us, we call him Dumuzid. All the traps were created by him. He knows this place through and through, making him a difficult opponent. So he used to be a human. Well, I'm not gonna lose to him. Now be faced with the creator of the Great Trials. Use all the techniques you've learned to avoid his fierce attacks. The time has come. Make it here. That was a marvel to watch. Well, it seems the others were altogether too easy on you. So for tonight's extravaganza, I shall deal with you personally. And you remember our deal, right? As I said, you have nothing to be concerned about. After all, tonight you'll be dining on my mutton special. It's a pity. But try not to get too worked up over it. Shut up! Let's get this over with already. I'll outrun you, too. Catherine, wait for me. Thomas Mutton has appeared. Right. It's the killer. Do not die. Edge. <laughs>
have any time. Boy, stop moving! Finally here. Above this place is a path that reaches to the heavens. You finally appeared. A man with potential. I've been waiting for you. Waiting for me, huh? Were you trying to kill me this whole time? This is a sanctuary where we give those with potential a baptism and freedom. This is a game of death where experience and intuition are your only tools to survive. There is no right and wrong. Tomorrow only comes for those with the power to overcome the challenge. Yeah, I kind of already knew that. This is all a dream in my head. If this is my dream, then no matter what comes my way, I know I'll be able to handle it. <laughs> you are bold. So different from the man who first entered here. My job here is done. You've successfully endured the baptism. Coming next will be the final trial of the heavens. This will be your last battle. I am always near you. I have many faces and many names. When this sanctuary is bathed in Ishtar's love, I'll see you again in a place far removed from here. Somewhere else? Keep your eyes up and go. Hey, you have to tell me twice. You sure love to talk right up to the end. The 
The final stage of the great trials is upon us. This is the ultimate test. Face the gods full power with all your might. When you reach heaven's door, you will gain true freedom. How long is this gonna go on? <sighs> Faster than I expected. Screw you! I'm not playing games here. I'm almost there. Who's gonna win tonight, bitch? What are you talking about? I was just messing around. Just making you come.
got it. To make me lose my cool weapon here. saving your race by being stubborn. <laughs> Is that still what you think? Look, men and women, they're more complicated than you think. You're just being selfish. All right, Mutton. What I want doesn't really matter. I mean, people's lives aren't planned out for them. There's no road map. Despite what you may think, we don't need any hurting. <gasps> I mean, I can't claim to be the greatest guy in the world or anything, but I am human, and I'm free to choose how I live. You... you insolent little man! Well, thank you, but I still won. You made me go through these stupid dreams night after night. From now on, my life is my own! <sighs> stop, stop it! And you climb the Imperial.
It's morning. Time to go. This is a pretty odd request. Why do you want to do this anyway? You promised me you'd get her to meet me. That's all I want. You say she's just an illusion, but I don't buy it. Well, she is an illusion. In this realm. But a promise is a promise. I can't stop you from meeting with her. Hmm. Very well. You should know, though, that she is not a resident of this reality. She is an ancient being who enters men's dreams to perform evil. I take no responsibility for what happens if you pursue her. Hey, you know what? Enough with the threats. Quit the chit-chat and just call her. She's already here. Take your time. My job here is done. <laughs> Catherine. Hello. <laughs> uh, hi. How have you been? I mean, it's... it's good to see you again. Yeah? I've never been called out like this before. It was really surprising. So, what do you want? You know what I am, right? Uh, yeah. Aren't you scared? Well, maybe a little. Hmm... Vincent, listen. I was only helping him out. On a whim. You're the one who wanted me, and you're the one who rejected me, remember? And now, you ask me to meet you here. What's this about? Well, I wanted to talk. With me? Yeah, of course with you. <laughs> what is it? Look, don't worry about it. I don't care that you dumped me. You, well, no, that's not it. It's not? So... There's something I want... Something I have to tell you. Okay. I'm listening. So, out with it already. I've made up my mind. Your mind? Before, I was worried about my future. I thought my life was being decided for me. But meeting you... I feel like I've overcome that. <laughs> What are you saying? You met me and overcame... what? I don't know how to say it. Society's all about patience and self-sacrifice, right? I mean, everyone practically kills themselves to stay safely within the herd. Hmm? But I hate that life. Even if it means I'm going astray myself. That's why I was willing to go through all of that nightmare bullshit. I made it out alive. I'm not in the herd anymore. Now that I've met you, I've lost all hesitation that I had. Huh? I'm... I'm totally free now. Together, we can both live our lives to the fullest without chaining each other down. Uh, I see. And so, I've decided... I want to live with you. Uh, live with me? Wait, what are you saying? <laughs> Living with me means... Oh, I can quit being human, if that's what it takes. 
I've made up my mind. Don't you believe me? Vincent? I want you. Let's get married. Marry me? We can do it, right? I, I don't know. I've never heard of such a thing. You can't stop it, Vincent. Jeez, mm. knock it off, will ya? Oh, good. I'm glad that you understand. Well, wait a minute! I haven't agreed to anything yet! All I want is for you to be with me. Y you can do whatever you want, okay? Whatever I want? You know I'm not human, right? That could present problems. Uh, such as? Uh, lots of them, actually. Besides, it's not like I can stay here with you. The thing is, Vince, the whole kid thing would have to be off the table. And I mean, everything I did to you, I might do to other guys. Oh, yeah. Why don't we just take it one day at a time? One day at a time? And you're okay with that? I'm sure we'll manage somehow. <laughs> What in all damnation are you prattling on about, eh? One day at a time? What utter absurdity! A mere human dares ask to wed the daughter of the plenipotentiary of the netherworld! Not in my house! You're his daughter?! Get out of here, Daddy! I'm having an important conversation, okay? So this guy's your father. You got a problem? <laughs> Let's go home. You promised you'd play video games with me tonight. Okay, uh, let's just cut to the chase then. I need to know, okay? No more games now, Catherine. What do you think of me, honestly? Uh, uh well, I am... Um... Hey, why the hell are you blushing? Are you embarrassed over a human? Oh, you shut up! <laughs> Jeez, how do I put this? Um, well, to put it in human terms, I guess... I... I like you. And I was spending time with you when I was supposed to be seducing other men. What on earth is going I on here? People, but... Okay, that settles it then. Uh, Marry me, Catherine. Uh, um, okay. No, it's not okay at all. <laughs> Never! You're not taking my baby! to be able to see you again. How'd you enjoy the show? A perfect escape from the terrifying nightmare. You led Vincent out with your exceptional skills. Even Astaroth, the mastermind behind the nightmares, was amazed. Did you happen to notice the central conflict that this game's masterful creators placed at its core? Do you want to live a comfortable and steady life? Or do you secretly long for a free life, full of excitement? In the nightmare, Astaroth said that there is no right way to climb the tower. The stairway Vincent was forced to climb could be taken as a metaphor. It symbolized the journey to adulthood, pressuring him to make his tough life decisions. Don't you agree? And the finale, mm, with Vincent begging not his ex-girlfriend, but the succubus to come back to him. Not only that, but asking her to marry him. Mm, talk about being wild. She was shocked, but it looked like she was pretty pleased by it. I gotta say, he said some interesting things while confessing his love. That in order to live a normal life, you need self-sacrifice and patience. And if he's gonna stick out, he might as well live freely. Vincent found an answer for himself during the nightmares. And maybe Catherine accepted it because it reached her heart as his true answer. Her reaction might depend on how well she can sense Vincent's feelings. <laughs> I think that their future might just depend on it. Now tell me. What did all you players out there think of this outcome? He said that he's willing to quit being human. Is that... <laughs> okay? Are you players who led him this far a bit worried about him? 
I just can't help myself. Let's take a peek into the future and see what happens next. <laughs> Games are lovely creations, aren't they? Hope to see you soon. Stay golden. Hey, how long have you been awake? All this time. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> it's not like you let me get any sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Top of the morning, kiddo. Good morning. No! What? What in the fuck? Don't mind me just laying around. Of course I mind you! Why are you in my bed? Oh, just ignore him. It's no big mystery, Vincent. He's here to stalk us. <laughs> sure. A stalker, huh? A stalker? That's a cruel way to put it. I mean, I am a god after all. <laughs> I'm working hard for the sake of the world. I hate this as much as you do. Yeah, I can't <laughs> doubt that. Don't worry. Just think of him as decoration. Besides, it's better when someone's watching. No! I love you, Vincent. Yeah. I really love you. Yeah, I love you too. <laughs>
Maybe I'll skip out on work today. You're slacking and getting kind of lazy, aren't you? Oh, come on. It's not like there are any men out there hotter than you. Of course not. Don't be silly. Mm. I can't believe a human man could be this incredible. It's so surprising, don't you think? Although, he's definitely not human anymore. Oh, I get so hot sitting near him. It makes me just melt away. You really are sinful, you know. What will you do with yourself? All these demons wrapped around your finger. <laughs> Everyone acknowledges your power now, my love. Right, Daddy? <laughs> oh, hey there, Dad. Didn't, uh, didn't see there. I don't even know what to make of it. A mere human with this much power is simply unheard of. <laughs> I was shocked too, Nergal. Yeah, I am a good fit for this world. Oh. Right, honey? Damn it all! <laughs> oh, Daddy, stop being difficult. Just give up already. Enjoy our story by taking control of our tormented main character and leading him to freedom. Take on the trials once you're adept at the game. Choose from the various stages of the Golden Playhouse and have a competitive climb-off. Change various settings in the game, such as controller vibrations and how to control the camera. Continue the story from where you left off 